नमस्कार दोस्तों वेलकम टू एस सी एल टेक टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ यू कैन रिमूव माई एस क्यू एल सर्विस फ्रॉम योर विंडोज इफ यू आर ट्राइंग टू इंस्टॉल माई एस क्यू एल वंस अगेन और यू आर इंस्टॉलिंग एग्जाम एंड इट इज शोइंग दैट द सर्विस इज ऑलरेडी रनिंग सो टूडे वी विल रिमूव फ्रॉम द बाई कमांड फ्रॉम बाई द हेल्प ऑफ कमांड फ्रॉम सो लेट स्टार्ट ओके सो एज यू कैन सी आई राइट नाउ आई एम इन माई एट माई डेस्क टॉप एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू आई विल check you uh, that uh, the service is in already in my uh, system so you go to the search and there you will type services and uh, the service is open and we will search for mysql and as you can see here mysql is running and uh, that's why the problem is uh, uh, saying that the mysql service is already running okay so we will delete it then we will install mysql once again or you are in your case you are installing xamp and the it is showing the error okay so let's start so first of all uh, to do this to do this we will go to the command prompt and from there we will do it so in the search you need to search command prompt and run as administrator make sure you have to launch it as run as administrator okay so after that there is a command that uh, is in the description or in you are seeing at the desktop sc delete and the service name that is showing so I will type same as it is like uh, capital my SQL. Okay, you can see here. So it is seeing that the it is deleted successfully. So our command is completed. Okay, and but there is one little problem that still this service is showing. Okay, and uh, as you can see here, uh, I will relaunch the service. And uh, if I am searching for my SQL, it is still showing and uh, it is running. Okay, so. You, if you you are thinking that the problem has not solved, but they there is one thing that uh, I will tell you in the last video. So as you can see here, the specified service has been uh, marked for deletion, but it is still not deleted. As you can see, it is still in the my uh, services. So what we are missing is we need to stop that service. Okay. So as you can see here, I have stopped that service my SQL. Okay. Right click and stop, and then I have refreshed it, and you can see. the mysql service is removed from the windows okay and now you can install your mysql server once again or xam server and uh, then you can easily do it so that was the video how you can uh, delete or remove mysql service from windows okay so that was the video those uh, friends how you can remove mysql service from your windows if you like this video then do like this video comment that uh, you have re uh, successfully removed this from your service and uh, let me know if you have any problem i will feel good feel good to help you uh, if you are interested in windows networking internet related videos then you can subscribe scl tech for more related videos like windows troubleshooting thank you so much for watching thank you very much